Okay, we're here in Mount Farm. He's riding the news riding the old buggy at the moment. Buggy head first. And you go around. Here's the old bike. I got the mountain bike. Try to do some stuff on it. I'll show you guys what I can do on the mountain bike. <laughs> now I'm gonna hop on the old bike now. This one here feels way different. <laughs> this one over here for now. Let me do it down back. Yep. Now I'm gonna get the mountain bike. This is the new one we got the other day. And of course, weather here sucks. It's cloudy and it rains a little bit, but nothing's made in danger here. This thing got some big old tires on it. Little fat tires. I'm gonna be jumping this thing for the first time here in a minute. I never jumped this bike yet. This brakes good on any bike. But these these are four by twenty six inch tires. Not a bad bike. The long as fuck. Just of course the big tires add some weight to it, so it's a little bit more heavier. But I'm gonna try jumping this a couple times and try to try some wheelies on it. So there's nothing jumping there. I never jumped this thing yet, so here it goes. Pause it a minute. Well, I went to go jump it and the bar shifted, so I had to stop for a minute and adjust the bars. So they're good now, should be. I'm going to try jumping it again. Hopefully this time the bars don't shift. The chain came off the derailing. Hang on, man. Uh, yeah, I think you chain now. That chain's supposed to be tight regardless. <coughs> Due to the, uh, the chain system. It's a very tiny chain. <coughs> <coughs> And then the hammer works a little bit That feels a whole lot different than your normal mountain bike. Heavier, definitely. Anyway, I'm going to do all the things I've done on you. And you think you ride a bike. You ride one every day. Took me a while to learn how to wheel it. Just get the wings back with all your might and make sure you keep your arms straight. Hey, but the animals fun out. I'm gonna move the ramp and try to do some wheelies up the driveway. I got the bike. Dropped it. <laughs> okay. you learn, this is called the Mongoose Dolomite Fat Tire Bike. It's about 300. About three hundred dollars to two ninety nine nine nine. Sorry, I'm kind of out of breath, but it was a birthday gift. It's a birthday my, gift. Uh, I'm from Missouri. Huh? I'm from Missouri. Yeah, my cousin came with me. 
bought it for me, but it's a pretty good bike overall. Fun to ride. Now I'm gonna see if I can do any wheelies on it. I'm riding a little bit better at them. Got front brake. Now I'm gonna try to wheel it. Here it goes. On that one. Yeah. But it's got good front brakes, good for stoppies. And back brakes. Awkward to turn a little bit, but I'll get used to it. That does feel kind of weird driving a little bit. Especially coming off that bit old BMX bike. I'm gonna go up here to the front of the barn and try to hammer down here as fast as I can to see how fast I can get going. I'd probably get going a little faster if I had bigger run-up, but... Yeah, well, his brakes... His brakes are good brakes, he needs to give him a head. Yeah. Well, that's not gonna be it for this video. Stop it real quick. Anyways, it's a good bike overall. I'll probably take off a ramp cup. Seven speed mongoose. That's a pretty good little bike. I like it. As you can see the see how big the tires are on that thing. But it's a good old bike. You got good front brakes, nice for stoppies, and I'm just now wanting to wheelie this thing. I tried wheeling my BMX a second ago, and once you hop off one of these on a BMX bike, if you don't know, it feels a whole lot different. BMX feels lighter and everything, but I'd probably sit the ramp back up and jump it a couple more times to see how high I can get it. So yeah, give me a minute, and I'll do that. That different spot uh, in the ramp, and right there. I want to try this out. I didn't hear me with it. <laughs> I'm over. We'll try. y'all don't know, this bike's like 60 pounds, so it's not hard to ramp. It feels a little weird, too. But it's pretty fun to ride. <laughs> There he is, on that one. Down shift it. Then chain came off again. I had to do a chain break and get a link out. Maybe.
And this is the last dog on this video. Here goes nothing.